Today I'm going to teach you how to make coaster overlays. Stick to the end for a bonus coaster overlay. Every coaster overlay is going to require the single rail coaster, but you can try with other coasters. We are going to start with the single rail overlay. Line up one side of the single rail coaster to one side of track. To make this process easier, paint every other track, like I did. I'm sorry that this voiceover is only on one side of your ear. I can't help it. If you have any idea what is wrong, please let me know in the comments. And while you're down there, hit the like and subscribe buttons as that would greatly help me in the channel. The simpler the layouts of the coaster, the easier it is to overlay. This goes with every overlay in this video. Once you're done one side, make another single rail coaster and line it up to the second side and then overlay the second side of track. Be patient and take as much time as you need. The end result will look super amazing and well worth your time. Moving on to the wooden coaster overlay. This overlay is a lot easier to mess up, but it's quite simple, weirdly enough. First align the wooden coaster to the vertical launch coaster. Try to be as accurate as possible. Be very careful about the chain lift. This can make or break the entire coaster overlay. If the banking on the vertical launch coaster is too much, then the entire overlay is ruined and you have to fix it. If everything is all good and lined up, you can continue to overlay the rest of the coaster. But remember, take as long as you need. The more accurate, the better. The next overlay is compatible with the motorcycle coaster or the extreme launch coaster and can be messed up by just a fraction, which is why I heavily recommend you paint every other track. This coaster is extremely easy to line up but is very hard to overlay. It is very important that you take your time and redo parts if needed because I'm telling you, it will make a difference. But other than that, it's the same overlay process as all the other coasters previous to this one. Now it is time for the bonus method that only Theme Park Tycoon 2 OGs know. This overlay requires the hydraulic launch coaster, the new one. Just overlay how you would with the extreme launch coaster or the motorcycle coaster. But once you get to the drop, pay careful attention because we're going to make the supports out of the overlay a popular technique from a while back. What you want to do is make the track go underground, then turn it to where it is facing up, then turn the supports off on the hydraulic launch coaster. Subscribe for more tutorials like this one.